Hey guys, it's Muddy Skies, and this is my first real video to make with a, a how-to. I got some new props from Master Airscrew, part number MRSL10 by 4.5, and um, these things, they're actually pretty nice. They're about $18 for the set of four, quite a bit cheaper than the... Um, the 3DR brand. They're polished. As you can see the shininess of them. What I'm going to do, because whenever you buy these, they come with these little nuts. These little nuts that go on there. Well, these little nuts fit inside the shaft. I don't know if you can see that. Trying to make it get a shot. There's the one with a hex side and the circle side. Well, the circle side goes down on the shaft of the motor. The hex side is what this fits in. And as normal, there's a silver side for the silvers part of the motor. And there's the black nuts that go on the black part of the motors. But every time you take them off, these come off. Every time. So what I ended up doing was taking some CA glue which you can get at the hardware I mean a uh, hobby shop and what I ended up doing was taking a pour quite a few drops of that down right here on this cardboard take a let me take off a couple of these props first so we can I can demonstrate exactly I've already done a set already and now I'm going to get to do another set for you. There we go. And the way I'm going to do it will make sure that you don't get super glue on your threads and then you won't be able to take it off. So, there's two different directions these blades. And these two right here are the same. You get another one that's not. Two of the blades. Two different directions as the normal silver and black would be two different directions so what we're going to do is I'm going to put a little super glue on the silver one which is going to be that direction as you can tell it's not the same so this is the one that we need set that aside get our silver nut ready put a little bit of super glue on the tip of the toothpick and then just dab it on the inside of a couple of two or three of the flat edges of that hex do not put it on the circle side and only do a little bit like this if you don't have a toothpick do something super small but you don't want that much and then that slides that nut slides right in there and then once you tighten it down on your motor again tighten it all the way down it looks like it gets a little it's a little bit of friction to try and get it down but once it seats you can tell because it won't go anymore and then just stop do your next one again a little bit um, three fourth the sides you want to do all the sides do all the sides but again you don't want to put too much you don't want this to be on those threads and then you got to try and fight to get that off you know how super glue can be so that slides right in there same thing on the black black nut black logo on that motor shaft Tighten it down until it tightens up. Then let it sit overnight or for at least 30 minutes or so until it gets good and solid. Then you won't have any problems. You can take these off, put them back inside of this really nice bag. It keeps them shiny, keeps them all together. Look at that bag. And you can also use it to polish them. You can also use it to polish your, uh, your GoPro, polish up your phone or whatever. Masterscrew.com. Masterscrew part number M R 
SL 10 by 4.5. Thank you for watching. Adios.